guys welcome to my channel thank you for clicking on this video it's a Mary Kay and if you have been a subscriber of mine for a long time then you know this is my first video in a very long time um, as you guys know from my previous posts um, I had some computer issues my computer completely crashed completely unrepairable so uh, it took me quite a while to really uh, save up some coins to get a better functioning computer that was going to be able to handle all the things that I do with it including uh, making YouTube videos and stuff like that that was no easy task saving up um, for two months to get all that together but nevertheless I finally made it through and I'm so happy to be giving you guys this video that I've been itching to do for the last uh, two months um, probably couldn't happen at the worst time as far as my computer it happened probably the day after the Fenty launch and in the middle of editing that video it just completely crashed on me so it's been kind of uh, hard uh, been kind of difficult to see all these beautiful videos coming out and review videos for a lot of different makeup that has come out uh, recently so I'm so excited to finally give you guys a review of my own so first uh, just to let you guys know if you are not subscribed to my channel yet and by the way I've been seeing everybody that has been subscribing so um, words cannot express how thankful I am to you guys that maybe probably have been recommending my channel I know I haven't been able to post you guys have been showing so much love to my last video so I really appreciate it if you are not subscribed to my channel please make sure you are subscribed as well as clicking the bell button down below so you're notified every time I post new uploads to my channel which will be much more frequently now <laughs> that I have a computer um, for this video today I wanted to do something short and sweet and give you guys a review of the Fenty uncensored stunner lip paint this is in the shade uncensored um, obviously you guys know that um, Rihanna has recently come out with Fenty Beauty by Rihanna and this is their newest release. Um, I'm looking forward to some other products but of course seeing this, this made me think about Rihanna's um, makeup collection with MAC that she did and she came out with this beautiful red called Riri Woo which was inspired by MAC's Ruby Woo so um, that was one of my favorite red lips so when she came out with this I definitely wanted to compare them both and see how they measured up to each other so I'll be reviewing both of these just to give you guys my opinion as far as is this worth it if you actually have Riri Woo um, you probably can't get it anymore more obviously since it was a limited edition piece but I just wanted to see how they measure up to each other are the colors the same what's the benefit um, obviously one's liquid ones um, are traditional matte lipstick so we'll get into it more of course subscribe and let's just get right into it so obviously uh, Fenty Beauty by Rihanna this is their latest release this is the Stunna lip paint in the color uncensored which is a really gorgeous red um, this came out Thursday I believe or was it no yeah Thursday November 23rd this is the wand it's a really interesting wand um, hopefully you guys can see that it's like almost like a bubble at the top just to start off this is the liquid lipstick obviously um, now this is Ruri Wu by MAC and this was from her collection with MAC Cosmetics uh, I actually bought two of these because I didn't want to run out I didn't know the next time I would get one but um, really I guess just side by side the colors kind of look similar I'm just gonna do a side by side swatch for you guys so you guys can see I think these both dry down to a matte and this is uncensored so right there you'll see this is um, this is the Mac Riri Woo and this one is still drying down this is uncensored by Fenty Beauty First off, just looking at the colors, 
first off just looking at the colors they do look pretty similar the one from MAC obviously looks a lot more matte and a little on the duller side compared to the Fenty color um, the Fenty color just looks a little more radiant a little uh, more lively the other one looks a little bit more dull but I think it's just because the formula is different um, obviously one is the liquid lipstick and the MAC one is the traditional lipstick so I think it just looks drier actually probably because not only is a matte lipstick but this collection came out um, a few years ago so the lipstick is probably a little more on the drier side but as far as color I think they're uh, still two beautiful colors so first I'm going to try on the MAC Riri Woo. I think overall it's still a gorgeous color. I think it works well for any skin tone. It looks really complimentary, especially on deeper skin tones. So I'm still loving it. I want to see how this compares to the Fenty one. I haven't really uh, played with this yet, um, but I have definitely always been a big fan of the MAC lipsticks. I feel like it's still comfortable on my lips. Uh, because it is matte, I think it's important to still no matter how good the formula is for any particular lipstick you're using to definitely still exfoliate your lips and uh, still have your lip care routine as far as moisturizing and exfoliation and all of that because the lipstick obviously isn't going to look good if your lips are crusty and hard so um Overall, I think this is still a beautiful color. Let's try on the Fenty. So now I'm gonna try on the Stunna Lip Paint and Uncensored by Fenty. See how this truly compares to Riri Wu. So this is the Stunna Lip Paints and right off the bat I can tell this is definitely more vibrant than uh, Riri Woo. For this to be a liquid lipstick, this is very comfortable on the lips for first impression. I definitely want to wear this for a couple hours to see how it really truly dries down and see how comfortable it really is once it's completely dry. But this. Um, just the color is really beautiful um still very comfortable i will have to say just right off the bat my preference would be the fenty one only because i've been more into liquid lipsticks lately i think they're just easier to deal with um maybe not necessarily any issues with mac uh traditional lipsticks but just traditional lipsticks all together especially this time of year when your lips are probably already dry it's just it doesn't really seem to be the most flattering for lips so uh, the fact that this is um, very comfortable for liquid lipstick is very surprising for me um, the only drawback I would say even though I think the packaging is very unique and very beautiful uh, the drawback for me would probably be how this would fit if I was like taking a small clutch or something like that because it's not a regular slender tube and it has like this cone shape to it where uh, it gradually gets uh, bigger uh, the further you go down I'm not sure how comfortable this would be to carry in a small purse or how it would fit in a super small purse but um because that's not really an issue of quality I don't think that's a drawback on the actual product itself I think the color like I said is very beautiful it seems a lot more here are the swatches again it's a lot more uh vibrant and these are completely dry at this point 
it's a lot more vibrant than um Riri Woo which is this one again and this is Fenty as far as the colors though I think the colors are still very similar it just seems like Fenty is a bit more vibrant so kudos to Rihanna she has not disappointed me um, so far with her Fenty releases I think she is really taking a lot of time and thought into these products and it doesn't seem like she just slapped her name on something and left a production and a formula and all that type of stuff to other people so I'm really surprised that um, these products have really held their ground as far as quality and really competing with some of the other bigger brands um, that we know of as makeup lovers so kudos to Rihanna I hope you enjoyed this short and sweet video just to get my feet wet back into uh, making videos for you guys if you have any suggestions for videos you would like me to do any products you would like me to review please leave them in the comments down below thank you so much for tuning into this video please give it a thumbs up and hopefully I'll see you in my next one bye